Mickey and Michael then competed in the uh, A800 early in this evening. So she's tough with taking this field round 67, so 67 and 214. And uh, from this distance, it looks like uh, already establishing themselves the front, Claire Carfley from Tony Long's Morley, but also the Art of Western Ireland, and Hannah England uh, from Oxford City. Hannah, uh, our former silver medalist from the World Championship 1500, coming now uh, into contention alongside Claire, it's number 160 there, Amelia Quirk. Amelia's having a great season over the long distances so far, so she's just stepping down this evening. So 67 was the target for uh, KTM as they went through the uh, first 400. It looks as if she's going to be just about spot on, maybe a 68 there. So, but uh, certainly she's chased hard. Amelia's now gone up into first place. Claire behind her, Hannah behind her. So the field very tightly packed as he goes down the back straight for the second time. <laughs> Looked to be a slight visible increase in pace from Katie as, at, uh, as they went through that uh, 200 point. But still the uh, field. We've got Amelia at the front behind the pacemaker. Still in there, Claire Tarpley, Hannah England. And uh, we have a, a new new face coming through that possibly, 171. That's Kirsty Fraser from Preston. So, and the field's still very tightly bunched. So we're looking at 214 as we go through the 800 metre mark. And it does look as if uh, Katie Alice uh, picked it up for the girls. So they're going to be around about the 2.16 mark as they go through there, 2.16, 2.17. But uh, Katie Allen's keeping it going for them, still Amelia there. Still uh, Kirsty Fraser from Preston. Claire Tarpley started to make a push, Hannah's still there. So those are your top four girls as they go through 600 to go. So Amelia is uh, just back from representing Great Britain at the uh, under 20s, where she was uh, under 23, so where she was fifth in the 5,000 metres. So uh, clearly having a great season and just dropping down the distance to get those speed in her legs. So if they approach the belt, Katie Young still taking them through. Amelia, she's followed by Kirsty and Claire and Hannah. Also up there, 162, that's Beth Kitchen from Brighton Phoenix. So they went through the belt in around about uh, 311, 312. And it's turning into uh, a really aggressive uh, race now. And it looks as if Kirsty's just uh, slipped to the front. She's followed by Hannah. Amelia's still working hard there. Georgie Hartigan's come through. So, Beth Kirsty Fraser at the front. Hannah Riemann tucked on her shoulders, still Amelia Quirk there. So, Hannah Riemann poised to strike as they come off the bench. And so she does, still Amelia Quirk in there. And on the inside, 167, Daniel O'Donoghue looking to sneak through. 162, Beth Kitcher. Finishing time of 4.16.59. So that looks as if it's a massive PB again for uh, Amy O'Donoghue. So she's taking it down from 4.18.84 down to 4.16.59. So good.